Today's sunshine made a big difference for drivers in Colorado Springs. Much of the snow and ice has melted. Most traffic returned to normal. Radio News Channel 13 Scott Harrison is live on Skyway Boulevard in southwest Colorado Springs tonight. And Scott, that's one of several lingering trouble spots. Well, Heather, here on Skyway Boulevard on the southwest side of town, this is a street, Skyway Boulevard, that's bigger than a side street, but smaller than a major street. And it's this type of a street that city crews were still trying to get clear today. And you can see how snowpacked this one still is. And today, we're updating progress in the city and in El Paso County. On the second day since the storm, the sun made work easier for plows, breaking up melting piles of snow and ice, reducing the danger of refreezing overnight. We found mixed reaction to the performance of local crews over the weekend. All I have to do is get on the freeway and get off. So I, I wasn't running around on the side streets or anything. The highway was pretty good. I mean, you go slow and it was fine. The road crew didn't do very good for any of the other streets. The uh, main streets, they're pretty slushy on the sides. So it's pretty hard going. Crew supervisors say near zero temperatures made their storm response more challenging. It just takes a little longer for those deicers to uh, activate and start working. Uh, so it tends to be a little bit of a waiting game. We do have to increase our application rates uh, to try and get the uh, snowpack and ice to break. Once that happens, plowing becomes much more effective. Although most of the streets in Colorado Springs are clear by now, you may find things a bit sloppy if you try to park downtown. Lots of slush and dirty slush at that. So just bear that in mind. El Paso County crews will finish up plowing neighborhood streets, something the city doesn't do after storms of this size. For the next storms, please give us a lot of space. With the pl give the plow space. For, we ran into some issues this weekend with <clears throat> Motor is still driving pretty fast, and um, I, I don't want to say crowd the plow, but getting close to the plows. Now, Colorado Springs will plow some neighborhood streets on hills, for example, if there is a safety risk. And very quickly, we did hear from CDOT late this afternoon. CDOT says they are pretty much finished with their snow response. We're live on the southwest side of Colorado Springs. Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.